So that's the slab protected. I've loaded the block out while Alex got the first mix in. We've had the laser up checking levels. So we're not working to now, we've got our measurements to go up. Then the window on top, and it's only two brick wide. So we just need to find a position then. Storm Agnes is coming tomorrow, so we've lined up an inside job doing a lintel. Oh, I didn't press record then. I just took that panel out all by myself. Oh, did you? Did, I don't think you did. <laughs> well, I got it out. I got it put it down. Right. We haven't done the intro like we usually do. We're, it's 8.24 now. We've got it. We've got 10 to 8. So we'll give you a quick one. That's yesterday's work. Got a bit of tidying up to do there with the fence panel was, even though the fence panel's going back. Picked the boards up from Sarah's this morning, Sarah and Stewart's. So that's the slab protected. I've loaded the block out while Alex got the first mix in. Well, he's put half a mix in to use the half a bag up. We remembered the stands and the boards, so we've now got four boards on stands. Our super rhino boards on our rhino stands. And some other green ones that we're not really that impressed with. So yeah, we're going to get the line set up. We're going to put a straight edge up on each door with our rhino clamps. So we're just running into it and not plumbing every course then just to save a bit of time and crack on weather forecast isn't brilliant it's meant to go a bit iffy in the middle of the day but hopefully we'll get away with it and tomorrow is storm agnes so we're trying to get a job on you know, on the inside tomorrow doing a lintel and a door opening so we'll see if that happens you'll see the video if it doesn't you won't well you will see the video because we're doing it we just don't know when so there you go, all the boards are set, lines are up, just got a few to run in there to raise the raise the line. So while Alex is getting them in, I'll get these these um, profiles up. So um yeah. let's get going.
Here we go, just after break. So that's ready for jointing. Alex is going to get a mix in after he's been in the toilet. I've just stopped up the bricks, put my trestles up and my hop ups up so I'm not bending. Massive help then. Yeah, everything's good. Got the uh, stabilizers on so the profiles aren't pulling over. Just keep going. There's a window on this on 14 course, it's a very small window. That's it, just carry on. Yeah, I've got the, the two profiles up for the doors. It's just but buff up to them, that's great. And that's it, I think. I think of anything else, I'll get back to you. So let's find somewhere new to put you for time lapse and crack on.
Alright, lunch over. Mix is spinning. Just getting it wet up. We've had the laser up, checking levels. So we're not working too now, we've got our measurements to go up. To get us to lint light and level. Looking good, these bricks are nice. That looks sent. So we're just going to keep going so we can't reach anymore. And then see how we get on. If we, if we do get that far, we'll jump inside. I'm just going to trace the pond round. Work out all the cuts and get all the cuts done. I've got a window coming in one, two, three courses. You'll just see there, I've got a pretty really tiny window for ventilation. The back course, so one, two, three. Then a window on top, and it's only really two brick wide. So we just need to find a position then. A bit of jointing to do. And then um, we crack on. Weather's holding. It's windy, but it's keeping everything dry. So apologies if you can't hear me properly. So Alex, once Alex is finished on his call, he's going to get the water through. In, he's going to get me a barrel of sto uh, soil first, just to level us up. We've been being like Bambi at the moment, so lift me up a little bit as well.
half past three. Bang on. Happy days. There we go. Windows set out. As I say, it's only a WC window, that's why it's high up. It's gonna be a little 450 by roughly 450 square. So this is this is at my end done. Mm. Scaffold height. I think we've got 18 on top of damp there. There we go. So now we can get this all this and we completely tidy up spotless because we won't be coming here again. We're gonna be working over and off the trestles from now on. Easy to easy for us to work from the inside. For um, how many courses have we got left? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven left on here. Yeah. Then the pikes, yeah. And um, seven to lint light. And then wall plate's obviously going to be a bit higher. So yeah, this can all be tidied up and done with. We don't need to come back in here again. We might, might just take that out for access tomorrow. Uh, sorry, Thursday. We're not here tomorrow. Um, Storm Magnus is coming tomorrow, so we've lined up an inside job doing a lintel. So that's open anyway. That one goes back tonight, but we'll see if we need to take it out or not. We've got a, we've got a way through there, but if it gets blocked, you can always come round. So I'm waffling again. Sorry. Yeah, there we go. Just wants a few little. I think Alex calls them bunny ears. Pulling in, just tidied up, and then it wants sponging off. Jobs are good. I mean, the clay commons matching them clay commons, so they're a good match for them. But they're double the price, them rascals. So, um, oh yeah, I've got that. I'm two and a half buckets in here. So. Get the damp course down and get the block work set out, and then I'll cut the first few down and bolster, and then. Once I've got the piece sizes, I'll put, I'll put the rest with the with the big Milwaukee saw we've got, which just flies through these um, fab lights. Great block, nice and light, easy to cut, very strong. You can fix into them, and they're good thermal value. There's nothing, there's nothing to dislike about fab lights. Great blocks. If you don't use them already, start using them.
Uh, we've got to do an outro again. Didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Well, let's just say the job wasn't exactly kind to us, so um, doing an outro was kind of the one of what well, wasn't on our priority list. It was a busy day. We got with pure brickwork all day. Yeah, so we did make some good progress at least. But that's the end of the video. So thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to give a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, you want to see more, hit subscribe and tap on that bell. It's meant to be a bell. <laughs> That way you'll always know when we upload, which is a massive help and a good uh, way to support the channel. And if you want to support the channel any extra ways, you can do the super thanks option under the video or there's a link to Dad's PayPal. Not necessary, but appreciated nonetheless. Every little bit towards uh, Dad's uh, trust fund <laughs> for his hip. We've had some very kind donations. Yeah, so everybody who's been donating, very very much appreciated. Thank you. So this has been lounging about in our living room with Steve and Alex. And we'll see you in the next one.